Lee bust, one to one replica. This is uncanny. I, I this I would say is a holy shit moment, and excuse my language, but when <laughs> we get I saw, one per show. <laughs> when I saw it, that's what that was exactly my expression. Just it's so crazy realistic. It's it's just unreal. Yes. Yeah, so as we mentioned uh, with the other pieces, this is medical grade platinum silicone. And the hair on this figure is hand punched. And yes, that includes the eyebrows. And yes, that includes the stubble and kind of mustache we've got going on here that is hand punched and then trimmed and shaved. The stubble is actually coming off the figure. And that's really creepy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, it, it, it is amazing. It's not just detailed. It's not just painted on. That is synthetic hair elements uh, that are actually hand punched into the silicone and then trimmed and shaved to get to the appropriate length and styling. These also are um, ocular uh, kind of prosthesis that really, really give you that lifelike eye look. Now, I know this is available for pre-order on our website right now, so you can check that out. Um, we do also have a fully detailed one-to-one -one costume here on, on the figure. You can see the fabric and the way that it is bunched up. It is, ooh, this is soft. <laughs> Sorry, this is my first time I've uh, put hands on this. This is a very soft fabric, recreating that. and. Um, Cameraman Sam, while we're here, can you focus on the hands and see if we can show them? They didn't forget the palm print and fingerprints. There's there's actual, uh, just, I mean, it's as real as a finger looks. I mean, that's, you can see that in there and it is insane. Of course, you got the folds of a hand and I'll, I'll hold up my one-to-one -one life size hand beside it so you can see. I mean, look at that. That's just unreal. Look at that. Yeah, this is crazy. <laughs> High five. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is amazing. And then the base is uh, inspired by the interior of the pagoda for Game of Death. Uh, on the back of the figure here, see if we can get him watch to your, spin. Watch your camera Watch there. the camera. Watch your six. Um, there's also... Uh, the, the, we see the dragon wrapping all the, uh, the way around, excuse me. And then we've also got uh, the symbol for Jeet Kune Do uh, on the back, which is just so cool. We're going to clear the wall, make sure. Uh, and you can see that he has his uh, nunchaku weapon uh, under his... Oh, and he's got, a, he's got a bracelet on his wrist. I just noticed that over here. Let's bend him back around. There, are, there is so much to look at on this piece. I mean, you can see he's even got hair on the back of his neck. Just detailed in there. Uh, you see the life, uh, there's the life-sized detailing of this costume. It's just an amazing tribute to such an incredible actor, martial artist, and more. You see that bracelet there down there? Yeah, so cool. Perfect. Yeah. Ooh, this is just an amazing, amazing piece. And again, I, I know we got to take a look at that face. Just absolutely uncanny, uh, even down to the individual eyelashes. Just such a beautiful uh, tribute to an icon of, of, of screen and of uh, martial arts. And that costume just so iconic in pop culture, whether it be Uma Thurman and Kill Bill, uh, so many people have replicated that particular costume.